Hi guys, my name is Prince Hiti and today we are going to learn the function concept in VBA, VBA macro. So there are basically two types of procedure over here, like first one is sub procedure and second one is uh, functions. So sub procedure we already done the same thing and uh, the function which we are going to do. Uh, the main difference between sub procedure and function is the sub procedure is done whatever we have told him whatever the commands whatever the statement we have written under sub procedure whereas in function function it returns a value like we do have some other functions like we do have some we do have length these kinds of functions so they returns a value either they throw an error or they return a value like i I am just mentioning anything over here like I have type prints so so len is my function and let's suppose I have given the reference of that particular text or uh, a cell and the output will be 6 so 6 is a return value like so over here we even though we already have uh, functions in Excel but uh, sometime we have to create our own function we do have our own logic behind it and we want our customized uh, uh, output over there so let's see how uh, they can be developed and how they worked over here okay so the basic uh, terminology I think you are already aware so I'll not concentrate much on on that that terminology okay so I'm straight forwarding I'm um, uh, reaching to uh, function concept so if you have uh, uh, some basic concept which you need to learn so for that you can view my previous videos Fine. so I'm just opening the VBA editor window I'm just pressing alt F11 and going over there and creating modules so the first concept is function function basically written in uh, modules not in sheets so module is a, a specific platform where you can write uh, where you can write your own uh, functions so I'm just typing a simple function uh, I'm just taking a simple function uh, how it will work over there so for that you can take keywords called function function and after that function name whatever the name you want to take uh, like uh, I'm giving a name get font name whatever fine so uh, okay backing over there so like earlier I have mentioned length sorry length of this thing so len mean to this is a function name d7 is the reference so reference whatever the reference you have given so is it a text is it a lem so you, you can say it as a uh, parameter you can say okay so same concept I'm taking over there so this is the function name get phone name and the parameter like I will give a range so let's suppose I'm taking a variable like X is a variable and s range range or whatever the reference you will take so as string So function and n function so like uh, I'm taking one more uh, variable like and the output where I want to put the same thing this is the name I mean where my value will be inserted okay so I want get font name would be having the information called cell oh sorry x dot font dot name okay so x is the range whatever will get going to select over there and their respective font and their respective name the output will be put into get font name which is our function name okay so I'm just showing how it's been work so like we do have a text value and uh, if you see uh, the font name is Calibri fine so if I'll just type over there get phone name so this specific uh, function name will be appear 
along with the fun other functions so I have just passed the value okay the same way and press enter so it will show you the Calabri font whatever the font is so like we don't have any specific function to just to check out uh, what will be the name of the text which I am going to refer so through, through this way you can create your own customized function so I'm taking one more example so that you could uh, understand it uh, in, in a in a more efficient way uh, like uh, on a daily basis what I have to do I'm just taking example firstly like on daily basis I get name and surname I'm just typing few information over here like I do have Prince uh, I do have Anu I do have uh, Anshika I do have uh, Ramesh I do have Asha surname would be Sethi uh, Anu Bajaj Anshika Aroda Ramesh again Malhotra Malhotra and Asha Rani whatever it is so all you want usually I get the data in this particular way so what I have to do on a daily basis I have to merge uh, first name and surname uh, along with that I need to put uh, uh, I'm sorry I need to put space in between name and surname and uh, the first letter of my name and surname should be in caps letter fine so usually what will you do like i need the output in this way so what you will do if you have a function you will apply concatenation function over there and apart from that you have to put uh, uh, space also over there manually uh, and you have to just make them in proper case as well so this could be a, a bit a bit difficult i means so if you want if you are using this kinds of uh, this kinds of output on, on a daily basis so you can create your own customized function so i'm just creating this thing so that you can uh, better understand uh, the function concept uh, okay so let's suppose i'm taking function function name function function name will be uh, like full name or whatever the name you want to give it it's up to you okay so over here I have to again passing the value so if I'll just show you over there how it would be look like like I will type full name over there and firstly I'll refer to my name I mean the first text and after that a second text so these two are the uh, parameter values I mean the parameter which we are going to pass okay the same thing so it means I'm passing two values so I'm taking let's suppose first value will be x which would be as a first string type okay again and second value second s again it will be a string type fine so this is the value which I'm going to pass so if you have more than a two or three or you can pass an option parameter also as well so the output the, uh, the output of the function will be in full name what I have to do uh, I have to firstly convert the same uh, means the first uh, letter of the name would be in uh, UK's uh, like UK's UK's X and after that I want uh, uh, blank space would be there and after that I want UK's and y will be there and and so on whatever fine okay you kiss sorry 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 i have to press and button over there just because there is no concatenation over here uh, we just manually concatenation it okay fine so let's check how it's been working over there is equals to full name so this is my first parameter and this is my second parameter I have taken is it as a U case so Prince will be caps space set will be in caps like this way fine so if you have a uh, lower case if you want the value in lower case so you can take as a L case or if you want the first letter of my name would be in 
caps and rest would be in in small letters so you can use uh, proper case so for that we have a specific function in inbuilt function library